So what is the history of poverty in America? Well, if we go back a little over 60 years to 1950, the percentage of the population in poverty was at an astonishingly high rate of 30%. With the nation having recently recovered from a massive depression and world war, many were still struggling to get on their feet. But what is amazing is that by 1959, the rate of poverty had fallen 7.5% to just slightly over 22% of the population. While this still was a high number, it was clear that the economy was beginning to improve. And as you can see by this chart, the poverty rate was down to 19% by 1964. But despite the major decline in poverty in just 15 years, President Lyndon Johnson felt it was time to take control with the declaration of the War on Poverty. Programs under this umbrella were launched in 1965 and 1967, and by 1970 would lessen the poverty rate to about 13%. Yet, history shows that poverty rates in the U.S. began to rise over the years, reaching 15% in 1983 and again in 1993, but mostly fluctuating between 11 and 15% never dropping below 10.5%. The most recent numbers from 2011 show that 15.1% of the population, and growing, continues to live in poverty. Imagine that you had written checks every month since 1965 for the service of alleviating poverty. If the trends are a measure of progress, would you feel it was a good investment? Or would you consider other ways earnings could help the poor? Visit www.actonpoverty.org today.